So let's take our orange down here and our uh, red, the CAD red light, and a touch of purple to kind of create the shadow effect color. Kind of creates a rusty orange. Actually, I'm going to put a little more uh, purple in there, I believe. There we go. Now there's a uh, separation here when it goes from one color to the next. But this will be the shadowed side. Now see again here, I'm not outlining. I'm pulling my brush in. I'm using square brush strokes. Again, just as a practical matter, I'm going to turn mine sideways also. <coughs> and the reason I'm taking my time to show you all the little ins and outs is because I want you to see firsthand how a pain goes together from beginning to end. Now we can do the white part. Well, actually, with, let's do the orange. Let's go ahead and take just pure orange with a teeny touch of white in it. Okay, so let's do this. See, I'm just going to put the white in there, it makes it look a little more sunlit. Again, you might want to turn it sideways. That way you get a good edge, but it's not just a hard outline like a cartoon would be or a, an illustration or something. Okay, now rinse your brush good. And the next thing we want to do is do the white. Now it's gray on the inside, which would be it's kind of like what we did over there. So you just take the white, a little touch of blue, a little sienna, and you make a gray color. Okay, <clears throat> then you take the white, pretty much by itself, but it's going to have a little mud in it. See how that works? It's really a lot of fun to uh, build this, <clears throat> these sails. I think it's kind of exciting. Now, right on the very edges, and you can see I kind of started up here, 
make it a little whiter and then it's a little grayer and I've still got, you know, i got a lot of work to do still on this piece. But what I will do now is I will, on the outer edge so it looks like the sun's really hitting it, I will take pure white, real thick, and add a teeny smidgen of yellow to it. And I'll go right on the edge like that. You see how it creates a little whiter look? Just a quick swish of the brush like this. Don't go all the way across, just stay around the edge. And then see that makes it look a little more rounded. And you can do the same thing on the orange and some of the other things. While you have that white on your brush, you can come in here on this sail and put a few dry brush strokes of sunlight. And see until that thing really starts to look three-dimensional. 